All right, so it looks like we're gonna get one more ride in this season. It's all of a sudden become unseasonably warm. Another Friday ELB ride, and as you as you can see, I took off the rear wheel cover. I've been I've been contemplating taking it off for a long time. I decided that I'm gonna go ahead and take it off of this because instead of using the trailer that we have, today I'm gonna use the trike carrier. And in order to use the trike carrier properly, I need to be able to fasten that rear wheel down so the trike doesn't slide off of the carrier. All right, so join us as we do probably the last Friday ELB ride of 2023 because the weather is about to change and the ELB doesn't like to ride in the cold. And to be honest with you, I don't either. Looks like some modifications are gonna be required for my trike carrier because the last time we carried the trikes on here, I didn't have the fenders on it, on the trikes. And now, the way this is set up, with this bracket here on the bottom, the one on the bottom, on the outside, won't allow the tire to just sit in there because the fender is in the way on the trike. So, a couple modifications coming up. Well, I can say one thing for sure. Removing that rear wheel disc sure makes airing up the rear tire a lot easier. All right, then uh, after a couple of adjustments there to uh, <laughs> get the trikes lined up just right, because my wheel is smaller on my trike, it's a 26 as opposed to a 700. You can see the difference in the wheel sizes there. This one fits much more readily on the trike carrier. I did have to take off the outside brackets to get it to fit properly, but I also had to move out this bottom, this bottom adjustment points for my side so the fender still wouldn't hit because when I put it on, the fender was still hitting. And so now I think I've got that adjusted all right, so the trikes made it safely to Dory Park, and we're gonna just head out on the Virginia Capitol Trail and cruise around. Looks to be a beautiful day. It's supposed to be in the mid 80s for the high today, which is just unprecedented for the end of October. Normally, the average high around here is like 67. So, it looks to be a great day for a ride. Here we go. Maybe they're getting ready to refurbish that little monument there. That's the one that used to have the orange bicycle on top of it. And it was vandalized. They repainted it. Maybe they're getting ready to fix it back up. Looks pretty nice. So we're coming out here the Friday before Halloween. And that's why everything is roped off. Looks like they're gonna have some sort of celebration out here probably on Halloween. So they've got everything roped off and They've got some concession stands going in and other things out here at Dory, but we're hitting it before all the crowds get out here. Things are crazy.
So we've got a brand new section. Well, not a brand new section. It's a uh, section of the trail that's been brand new repaved. It's super smooth. It's really nice. So, uh, yeah, cool. Doggo. <laughs> Doggo wanted to play with us. Yeah, this section of trail is really nice with a fresh coat of asphalt on it. Or maybe it's just... Huh? There's already holes in the asphalt. Well, maybe. I can't tell if they did a new asphalt or if they just put a top seal on it. But still, it's nice and smooth. So today the ELB didn't want to take the the hill at the Verena Library, so I did it. Turned around across on the other side of the tollway, right about the same time she was turning around up here. And now here she is waiting on me. Baby. Baby. Did they, the they did. Yeah. So she just reminded me that little bridge down there was one of those bridges that had a terrible bump in the transition from the bike path to the bridge. There's still a slight bump there, but not nearly as bad as it used to be, so they fixed it. So, thanks Virginia Capital Trail and VDOT.
Yeah. And they like you too, Ronnie. Yeah. Hey, so, yeah, you man. know, here we are. We're back at Ronnie's. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Y'all come on down to see me today. It's a beautiful day to eat barbecue. That's right. Or, <laughs> or any weekend for that matter. It doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah, yeah. Ronnie yeah, be out here smoking up some barbecue. Mm -hmm, yeah, yeah. One of the better days of the week. Yep. That's it. Yeah, probably be one of the best days of the month the way it's at. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Beautiful sunny Friday afternoon. Come by and get some barbecue. Yes, yes. Yeah, so we treat you right, that right. <laughs> That's right. And come meet the man himself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, we'll <laughs> Another wonderful meal at Ronnie's. You know, if you haven't been here, you guys need to come by here. It's right on the Capitol Trail. You can't miss it. It's Friday, Saturday, and I think Sunday. Come by and get some of this barbecue. I think it is the best barbecue I've had. Definitely the best barbecue I've had in Virginia. So make sure y'all stop by Ronnie's and get some barbecue. Sorry, I didn't know where you were. <laughs> I was taking up the whole road, driving right down the middle, just because, you know, I'm a YouTube star and I'm filming everything. <laughs> Almost as bad as being in my phone. It, another beautiful ride out on the Capitol Trail with the ELB and another lunch down at Ronnie's. Man, you guys got to go there. All right. Thanks for watching and riding along. Till next time. Cheers. Say cheers. Oh.